ScanEasy is an NSF explorer and data editor, plus a comprehensive toolkit for Lotus Notes databases. To start, it allows you to see and edit the raw data inside Notes documents. So first, let's look at this document. Here you can see the document's full contents, all fields and their values. And to edit fields, just point and click. So you can edit a field directly with this Field Value tab. You just click OK and Save. Remember that in Notes, seeing and editing document data often requires coding agents and creating views, and this will only work if you know what you're looking for. With these tabs, you also have the Note Info, the Readers and Authors fields, which can be edited, and the parent response hierarchy can be navigated. So to go to the parent, I just click this button and I can click on a response to navigate to it. Other document options include the ability to copy this document to another database or move it to another database. And you can delete this document. And here we have the option to not create a deletion stub and also delete responses and sub-responses. You can even modify the universal ID. You can also compare and mass modify fields across collections of documents. To do this, select a category of documents in the selection tree on the left, and the diff panel appears on the right. Clicking the diff button will show a compare and contrast table of all the fields that were found in this collection of documents. And this column gives us a quick synopsis that is, whether the field is present in all documents, or if the values are the same or different. And to see each value, click the Values button. Here you can select one field or several. You can think of this as a view on the fly. Here field values may be sorted, copied to the clipboard, or even exported. And with the Modify button, you have two choices. You can either set a static value for the field to change this field in all selected documents, or you can use the Set Value Using Formula tab, which lets you apply formula. Let's change everything in the subject field to uppercase. Once again, we can confirm these changes were made to all the documents in our collection with the Values button. A developer might need to create several agents and views to accomplish something similar to what ScanEasy can do in a few clicks. And ScanEasy will never tie up your session because it runs independently from notes. ScanEasy also offers powerful document search options. The search in Notes Domino is rigid. Your choices are full text searches, writing an agent to put documents in a folder, or view selection formulas. Your search results are limited by what the view or folder will show you. ScanEasy suffers none of these limitations. Some search options include searching by universal ID, by note ID, search by formula, and note here that search by formula allows you to save formulas. All search results will then be placed in a new My Selection virtual folder. A quick retrieve using contents of viewer folder is a very fast search option as it uses indexed information and search by using full text which is the same as in notes. ScanEasy's My Selection virtual folders are not only used for search results, they also allow you to temporarily group together anything inside a database for analysis or mass modification. This is much faster and more convenient than creating temporary views with the designer. The My Selection menu includes the option to rename selections, recategorize a selection, and if you have more than one My Selection folder, this Set as Current Selection option lets you choose which one is active. Here I have two folders and the second one is current. This checkbox selection menu also allows you to add checked documents to the current My Selection virtual folder, remove them from the current My Selection folder, or intersect them with the current My Selection folder. Taken together, these tools help you easily gather very specific collections of documents. And 
Remember that you can perform the diff operations on my selection virtual folders. ScanEasy even lets you customize the document titles shown here in the selection tree. This is a deceptively powerful feature because it allows you to gather complex selections of documents. First select a category of documents in the tree and click Change Displayed Title. You can generate titles from a field value, a formula, or even a column value. You can even show information from associated documents across other databases when you use a formula to generate titles. You can also do this from the document level. This lets you quickly use any field as your source for document titles. And this Select Using Regular Expression feature is especially handy to use in conjunction with the Change Displayed Title. It's important to note that you can use certain formulas here that cannot even be used in a view at all, such as at get doc field, at get profile field, at db column, or at db lookup, etc. ScanEasy's selection tree makes it incredibly easy to see the full contents of a notes database. Many first-time users are shocked to see all the junk that's in their databases that Notes and Domino never let them see. You can select the database icon at the top of the tree to see database level properties. So for example, you can create, copy, or paste the replica ID. And you can select the ACL on the tree to easily see and manage ACL entries and roles. You can expand the designs to see all design elements. This gives you access to the raw data. And notice the ability here to instantly see profile documents. This is one of ScanEasy's most popular features. Here profile documents can be edited like any document. And you can see all deletion stubs. These can also be deleted. And you can expand the conflicts in the tree to find and see all replication or save conflicts in a notes database. ScanEasy's dedicated Conflict Solver tool lets you instantly spot the discrepancies between parents and conflicts and selectively merge the good data. With the Conflicts category selected, launch the Conflict Solver from the toolbar. You can see all the conflicts are queued and ready to go. And you can check this option to only show fields with different values. Then select the field values you want to keep and click Solve to resolve the conflict. This keeps the parent document and merges any fields you selected, and the conflict document is deleted. And, if you want to solve just one, there's no need to scan all conflicts in a database. ScanEasy also lets you directly resolve a single conflict document with the Resolve This Conflict button. ScanEasy's replication tools include both a replication auditor and a post-replication auditor. Replication in Notes usually works great, but when it doesn't, the problems can be very difficult to troubleshoot. ScanEasy offers a replication auditor to preview or simulate replication between a database and its replica on the server. This lets you spot problems before they even occur. First, the replication auditor will look for a valid replica on the server you choose. And then, grouping by the push-pull header, you can see details before a replication. So this can help spot potential conflicts and other issues. From the right-click menu, you can edit and compare documents side by side. And deleting in the replication auditor will remove the document without creating a deletion stub, which allows you to change the future, so to speak. One more thing, you can enter a date here to see the recent changes that have been made to a database within a given time frame, or what's been modified in this file after this date. So remember that the Replication Auditor is the only tool that will tell you what changed in a database within a given time frame. So you can answer questions like, what did I just replicate, or which design did I just update? And the Post-Replication Auditor helps you discover ghosts or resurrected documents. 
These can then be either deleted or added to a folder for further analysis. ScanEasy's Notes INI editor lets you apply changes to the INI file live. So you can sort, search, and directly edit any notes any entry. Changes are applied immediately with no need to restart your notes client. And when the currently selected database is on a server, you can access the server notes INI editor as well. Thank you for watching this introduction to some of ScanEasy's basic features. For more in-depth information, please visit this link.